Hello and welcome back. We are at the Tower of the Gods. And uh, let's look around this place. Right, these walls over here, they kind of look bombable to me. So I'm going to try this right here. Boom. Alright. Cool. Oh, I missed that one. There we go. I don't know if I can actually get over there quite yet though. Let's see what happens uh, when water rises. Uh, maybe I can get out and jump over it this way. Yeah! Alright, here we go. And uh, we got electric shoes. Electric shoes. Um, is there a way to beat these? I'm gonna um, try using my boomerang here. See if this works. There we go. That is how you beat those things then. Hmm. Statues. That you can lift. I'm guessing this goes over here. Oh no, no, don't do that. Come on, Dave, we wanna put it down here. No? That looked like a switch or something. No? Oh well. So I break all these parts. Um I think I figured out a way how to make these um full widescreen. I've been messing around a bit. And I think I figured out a way to make these full widescreen, so I'm gonna try that after this recording is done. Obviously, you guys, when you're watching this, already know if it has worked or not, because it will be full widescreen. But yeah. What have we got in this treasure chest? We got the compass! That's pretty cool. Not really, but hey. Hmm, I'm wondering if uh, there's anything I can do with this eye here. Because in Ocarina of Time you can hit those eyes, but you need a specific item, which is not an item that we have right now. So I guess it's kind of pointless coming this way right away. Yeah, okay, and the statue's moved. Hmm. This does look kind of suspicious, though. Oh, well. Well, oh, okay. Yeah, that's what those sticks up there were for then. Right. Uh, the only thing, um, in my uh, test recording when I was, I was going to try and test see if I could do this full widescreen. And uh, for the first time, which is kind of lucky um, this happened during the test and not during an actual recording. But uh, the recording... I had a like failed message saying uh, the, the, there was an error during the recording, and so yeah, that never happened to me during an actual let's play. But that's kind of got me worried that this might not record now, <laughs> which is the whole reason why I oh joy pendant, okay. Um, kind of got what I was saying, but whatever. It's kind of got me worried that uh, this might not save, but which is the reason why I haven't been saving during the actual game itself. I don't know if I need the red lion to get anywhere over here, or if I can just swim over like this. Alright, this place has a lot of, like, doors from the, uh, main room. It's not as straightforward as, uh, the dungeons up to this point. Um, okay. Yeah, I'm guessing I have to push some blocks around, maybe. I've only got nine bombs left, that sucks. Um, am I too close to that? Yep. Oh well, that was pretty funny. I think I'm going to have to move these boxes, but I'm not sure where I want to move them to. 
so water level water level rise up what there was nothing in you grr all right okay I'm gonna need a box right there it seems I could like open this one and place the bomb over on this far side over here yeah, there's nothing in that one either. But there's a treasure chest in this one. Uh, dungeon map? Yeah, it's probably the dungeon map. Yep. Because we have to fight things for anything good in this game. What evs? Oh, did that yellow... Those yellow chews respawned. Come on, grab this, Dave. Need this on the far side over here. Uh, push it, push it, push it. Um, this isn't gonna help me much. I'm gonna have to time this right or something. Now, no. Yeah, I kind of did that on purpose. It, well, it's just a yellow chew in there. There's just a yellow chew in it. I am so... Wait, 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 wait. Nah, that won't work. I was thinking that you could like put one of those boxes on them. Um, well, I'll show you now when we go down. There's nothing I can do about these shoes right now since I'm in the water. Yeah, on this thing, stop the water level rising. But it doesn't look like they're gonna get over to there. Ah, uh, you're surrounding me. You and I in shoes. Um, there has to be something of some significance in this room. There has to be. I'm gonna take out all these shoes and see if that does anything. Although I'm not that confident that taking out these shoes will do anything. Come on, get up, get this run, put the water level right in this, there we go. No. They didn't do anything. <clears throat> Alright, I'm guessing that's all that's in this room then. There we go. Oh, and the red lion uh, sailed over here. Hey, red lion. Um, it doesn't look like I'm going down there, so... Oh, I'm going to have to go the long way around here now. Steer. Steer to the over here. Oh... Uh, yeah, this um, rising and lowering of the water levels. Yeah, that could get annoying. I hate having to wait to do stuff in video games. I really do. There we go. And it looks like uh, these... Wait a minute. Wait a minute. You may have to put those statues over here. But you have to do them both. Like one right after the other. Like while Sin is still in this room. But we'll do this for now. See uh, what we get through here. If we have to do that, then we'll come back to that room. Um, we'll do that a bit later. Okay. Um. I want to go down there to see. Lift. Drop. Okay. There's a cool, colorful bridge type thing. Yeah, yeah, I guess that is what would happen. So, yeah, just wait for the water level to lower. And then we should have a bridge to the other side, yeah. That is so awesome. It's 
It's kind of Indiana Jonesy style. Um, okay. Okay. I'm guessing it's not the statues we put in those uh, spots. I'm guessing it's these things right here. So, yeah, I'm guessing that's why the door is, you know, glowing over here. Just to let you know you can, you could take this out of the room. And I'm guessing this goes here. All right, okay. And that opens that gate, right? Okay, cool. I'm back, Red Lion. Do I even need to get in the Red Lion? It's kind of weird. This is like the first dungeon uh, the Red Lion has accompanied you actually into the dungeon. I don't know if we actually need him for anything. Um, okay. Okay, so there's two statues, there's two of them, this looks pretty easy. Well, it didn't look like I needed you, Red Lion. Yeah, I don't know why he's here. I can do this dungeon without him. Every possible route, I can just swim there. And you get on there. Oh, this one's... Yeah. There we go. <clears throat> hmm. It looks like I need these. But I need to maybe line up the boxes to be able to get over there, or maybe not. Maybe I can do this. No, I didn't mean to light it. Sorry guys. I should have just jumped down and got onto the first box. That would have probably made this a little bit easier. Okay, box, box. Uh, uh, yeah, I'm gonna have to... I probably only have to move this one right here. The one I'm standing on. It looks like I'd be able to do it if I can just get this one over here, like this. Yeah, that looks good. Come on, give me a stick. Yeah, this is how it's done. Okay, what possible use could this treasure chest have exactly? Oh, small key, okay. Yeah, I know where there's a locked door. I know where this key will be handy. More electrical chews. These guys are the only enemies we've come across so far in this dungeon. Yeah, we'll take the red lion, why not? Since he's here, let's travel these waters with a little bit of style. There's no point really getting up to sail. There's like no wind to uh, carry us faster. So this is about as fast as we can go. I don't know, if anything, this seems like the slower way to get to the other side. But if you just swim, it's kind of like a little bit more dangerous it's probably because I mean the reason the red lions is probably because when you do swim you only have a limited time to swim that kind of makes sense because that bubble appears giving you a limited amount of time all right cool we'll just wait for this to uh, lower I do remember the locked door being this door down here. Oh! 
Get away from me. No one likes you. 